My name is David Foster and I'm so happy to talk to you today about one of my favorite subjects, music. I know that cutbacks are a constant in our lives and God knows the last year and a half has wreaked havoc on all of us. It has shaken all of us to the core and sometimes I wonder if we will ever get back to normal. Many, many years ago, when my hair wasn't gray, my normal was Lansdowne Junior High and Mount Doug High School. While attending those two schools, something extraordinary happened to me. I discovered band and a couple of amazing music teachers that truly helped me shape my life. Bob Bergeson gave me the freedom in band class to really reach a potential that I thought I had, but I just didn't know how to get there. Dave Dunnett from nearby Oak Bay School went out on a limb to help me in ways that I can't describe. And I still think about those two men almost every day of my life. Band was my savior. Sadly, I, I wasn't a very good student, but music and band in school was the one bright light for me. This is the God's honest truth. I would not be the musician I am today if it weren't for this school program. I lived it, I loved it, and I appreciate it every walking day of my life. Most people know the statistics of children that have music in their lives. They are better students, they're better citizens, and it keeps them focused and less likely to wander. I was certainly no angel or star pupil during my high school years, but music and band and those great teachers kept me out of trouble and I learned valuable lessons. Not just about music, but also how to work as a team player and think about more than just myself. Now, as I said before, we all agree that times are tough. With 10 middle schools and 28 elementary schools, it seems like a drop in the bucket, but these are real lives, real teachers who deserve to make a good living and students that deserve to be taught the universal language of music. I'm a guy from Victoria who benefited so greatly from what the schools had to offer me. And there are plenty more like me still to come that want to have music in their lives. I want to thank my longtime friend and collaborator, B.J. Cook, who has been such an advocate for music in the schools for many, many years. I join her now in hoping that the powers that will be, the powers that be, will take my story to heart and really try to keep the music programs alive in those 38 schools and all the schools in Victoria. The students need it, the teachers deserve it, and the world will be a better place for it. Thank you for listening. I am a grateful student.